I want people to understand that Code Next alone will not solve our affordability issues as a community, but Code Next provides us an opportunity to really address some of the challenges we're, we're experiencing around affordability and affordable housing. Hi, I'm Mandy DeMeo. I'm Executive Director of Housing Works Austin. We're a nonprofit organization based in Austin, and we do research, education, and advocacy around the topic of household affordability. So I think there's two different ways that the code can impact affordability. One is through legally restricted affordable housing, so really below market housing. And the other is just by increasing diversity of housing types, so hopefully getting a wider array of price points and kind of increasing overall affordability. So so Code Next can impact how Austin grows by helping us realize the vision that is Imagine Austin. So in 2012, after several years of community input put in dialogue, um, City Council approved unanimously Imagine Austin, our comprehensive plan, which uh, is like a 30,000 foot view of what the city of Austin should look like. Um, and that includes across the city of Austin, centers, activity centers and corridors connecting those, those centers, and, and these should be spread throughout the city of Austin. Code Next will impact the region as a whole. Obviously, it's focused just on the land development regulations in the city of Austin, but the city of Austin is really the, um, you know, it's the economic engine for the, the larger region. Um, and I think from a household affordability perspective, if we can provide increased housing opportunities within the city of Austin, that takes some of the pressure off of outlying areas. It also takes a lot of the pressure off of our transportation infrastructure system, our two biggest issues in the city of Austin, really in the region as a whole, affordability and mobility. And those are really interconnected. So if through the land development code, we can help to tackle our affordability challenges locally, that'll help um, from a regional perspective, help solve some of our transportation and mo our mobility and our affordability issues as well. I think it's important for everyone to get involved and have their voice heard about Code Next, um, and you can do that by going online, which is austintexas.gov backslash Code Next, and on there there's some opportunities for you to look at the maps around the code, as well as provide online comments, um, and there also is a listing of all of the upcoming community engagement events. You can also find those on our website, housingworksaustin.org.